Hey guys, uh, Smokey. Nacho. Uh, so we've got a little, uh, this is more of kind of like a half work, half fun thing. Uh, the work thing is that we're going to properly demonstrate how to decant a bottle of wine. Uh, now that the holidays are coming up, people are going to be coming with your bottles of wine. You'll be like, yo, let me show you this cool trick. And you're going to decant a bottle of wine for them. Uh, the fun part is that we're going to drink the bottle of wine after we're done decanting it. So, uh, let's walk on over and uh, learn how to properly decant a bottle of wine. Alright, so, first off, you want to have a decanter, and then you want to have a wine glass, and you're going to have a couple wine glasses, and then you want to have a bottle of red. Uh, we picked a nice bottle of Bordeaux, and then you want to have a candle, lighter, and a wine opener. So, first off, you want to do this. So, the reason you raise this up is so that you can actually see into the wine, into the wine bottle, so you light your candle. So you light your candle and normally the table would be a little bit lower so you're looking down on it. This is a little bit high for me, so I'm just gonna put this right there. The again. All right, so the next thing you wanna do is you always wanna split. Now most of the time when you open up a bottle of wine, you're just taking the top part off right here. So you want to like, you take that top portion off, always underneath this portion here. But the thing is, is when you're decanting a bottle of wine, you need to see all the way in. So you want to take this entire labeling portion off, so that you get this view right here. Okay? So then the next thing you want to do is you want to take your corkscrew and you wanna gently push it on the top. Kind of goes around seven times. Take your way course through once, twice. Now with an older bottle of wine, it's gonna be a little bit more difficult and have a little bit of, you know, you wanna be gentle pulling your cork out. So now you've done that. So now this is the fun part right here. You're gonna take the wine, you're gonna take your decanter, and you're gonna go right over the top. And you're just gonna slowly pour it. And the thing is, is this is still like a fairly new young wine. But once you get to about halfway spot here, you get your, it's over the light so you can see. Pick the candle, up, or pick the camera up. Go right over the top to see what I'm looking at. So that you can see that there's that little area in there where you can see the light coming through. And that's so you can see any of the old sediment in the bottom of the bottle. So you're seeing that little light in the bottom. That's the candle showing you where the sediment would be in the bottle if you were pouring out an old wine and had sediment in the bottle. And that's why you'd want to stop and you have the candle so you have some sort of light. Tasty. Happy holidays. So, what did we take away from this episode? One, that decanting a bottle of wine is pretty easy once somebody shows you how to do it. So hopefully you can take this knowledge and apply it to either impressing your folks, uh, doing it at a table while you're working as a waiter, if that's something that you do, or just to impress your lady friend to help finish and make the night even better. Or just to, you know, serve yourself a proper glass or of just aged wine. Exactly. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, we enjoyed tasting these wines and drinking them all up and stuff like that. It was yeah. a good time. And uh, we'll see you next time, when, uh, which I guess is like in a week or so for Thanksgiving. You know us. We try to push one out every week, but... Uh, it doesn't happen. I mean, if we push one out every week, we'd just still be in the summertime. <laughs> But we've got Thanksgiving episode coming for you. I'm going to make a turkey. 
This guy's gonna make some potatoes. We're gonna bring in the special nacho special lady friend. She's gonna do some uh, green bean casserole if we can maybe get her on film. Maybe we're gonna have a nice. Uh, we're gonna have a nice smoky Thanksgiving. nacho uh, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. So that goes to like our families. Don't worry, we're gonna be with friends and you know, friends. No, I'm not his loved one. So, <laughs> but we're gonna have a good time. So we're gonna take you along with that, like how to make a turkey and everything, and have a good time. So we'll see you soon. All right, guys. And don't forget to push. Like, like and subscribe. subscribe.